Qatar and Ramallah at the Centre of Palestinian Authority. Uh, we were here at a, an event um, jointly organised by Hilik Bar from the Labour Party and the One Voice Movement. Um, we had several hundred Israeli students uh, meet with the Palestinian Authority President Mahmoud Abbas. What we saw today really was Mahmoud Abbas, the politician, the diplomat. Um, quite an extensive interview was given. Um, he gave, he set out what he said were his uh, key positions on uh, on all the all the key issues. Um, there, was, there was a chance for questions. Some were answered. Some answered not so uh, not so well. But um, I think it what was what was really quite striking was the uh, the sheer numbers of uh, of youth that came. <laughs> יליד צפת, שכמוך נולד בעיר צפת, ואני מביא לך גם את ברכתה של בירת הגליל צפת, שאתה בטח מתגעגע אליה, ואולי פעם תבקר בה כתייר. הטרף האחר, או הטרף הטלת, הוא הנטו. Among some of the topics that he, uh, that Mr. Abbas dealt with, uh, were... For example, uh, things like water, borders. Among the more perhaps controversial issues were questions that were raised, such as uh, his whether he would uh, accept, whether he believed that there was a Jewish, that the Jewish people were a nation. This was one of the kind of questions that he refused to answer. Uh, other questions include whether he would agree to a split on Harabayat on the Temple Mount, which he answered a very resonant no. He was very, very firm that he would not uh, split the Temple Mount. The Temple Mount should remain uh, as. Um, as Palestinian, he did not address the issue of that uh, one of his uh, own ministers, the religious affairs minister, uh, who said, of course, that the Kotel, the Western Wall, should also remain under Palestinian, Palestinian rule. He seemed to to to, uh, in, uh, to imply that he didn't agree with that. He said that the, the Kotel would. He seemed to say that the Kotel should be a Jewish site, but he didn't say necessarily who politically uh, would rule there. Another exa another issue that was brought up was the issue of uh, the Jewish minority in a future state of Palestine. This is something which has come up uh, on a number of occasions. Um, he was uh, markedly evasive on this point. Uh, he sort of resorted to, I suppose, demonization. He said, you know, he, 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 the, the settlers are uh, an obstacle to peace, full stop, that they're killing and all that kind of thing. Um, he did not sort of, he would not countenance any kind of uh, solution which would include uh, the settlements, the set, the Jews in Judea and Samaria who are currently there remaining there. He said after the borders were drawn, perhaps. Um, that was one of the kind of questions that he uh, was less uh, open about uh, answering. Some of, the more, some of the easier questions, of course, uh, we, had, we had several left-wing uh, students, of course, comparing the Palestinian authorities' approach favorably uh, to the Israeli government's approach, which obviously was something which he uh, quite uh, adamantly agreed with. <laughs> قولوا لنا ماذا نفعل شكرا لكم والسلام عليكم. This is Ari Safa from Arut Sheva speaking at the Mukata in Ramallah.